I would say good morning, but it's already 1.37 on Sunday, October 13th, I think. Anyway, I'm out, as you can see, in the car running errands. I wanted to get a little bit more of this, although I can't remember what it is exactly. I thought I got it at Walmart, but evidently I didn't because none of the Walmarts by me have it. I'm gonna stop at Joanne's on the way home. I have to go that way anyway because Mr. also needs half and half for his coffee. And why are all the Walmarts out of half and half? They're, and their dairy section's like half empty. It's a little weird. So there's that. I did find some coffee. Tim Hortons Dark Roast. So, but yeah, so I thought it was going to be like a quick errand. Pick up some half and half. They either have the yarn or they don't. I did not think that the half and half was going to be the hardest thing to find this morning. But it is. I don't know why it is. But it is. So yeah. Fun times. All right. Why do I have this feeling this is going to be our new camera angle? <laughs> anyway, it's Monday morning. It's 10.16 a.m. I'm not babysitting today because um, Junior's other grandmother is still in town for one more day. So she leaves late tonight, but she's going to babysit him today. I'll babysit tomorrow. And uh, yeah. <clears throat> I have counseling tomorrow, which is probably a good thing because... Um, you know, mentally I just have um, not nothing too serious, but just I'm having one of those struggling times where I just don't want to leave the house. I don't want to get out of my chair. I just, yeah, so I'm making myself get out of the house today. We're gonna go do some thrifting. I do have some creative things I wanna do and rather than shopping online for stuff, tempting but yeah let's not do that I'm gonna go see if I can find something that'll work at the thrift shops um, I'm not gonna drive too far I'm gonna go to the ones in town that are open and I do have to go to Walgreens and pick up some um, cream that I use on my face I also have with me one of my art kits and so the idea is to do at least one mini sketch before I come home somewhere probably sitting in the car. So, all right, let's go see what we can get done today. I'll be back.
Okay, guys, what time is it? I don't even know. Um, 3.59, just before four o'clock. I did some cleaning and straightening today, rearranged a few things, didn't expect to do that. That wasn't on my list of things to do today, but I am getting rid of probably half of my crochet thread. I never use it anymore. I do have a project in mind for um, some of the other thread, but this can all go, I'm never gonna use it. And I've, as I've inherited or been gifted yarn, there's always like one or two balls of crochet thread in there and I just never get rid of any of it. At, but I never use it either, so it's gotta go. Um, I also made five more pin cushions, um, some of which are still drying. So I had the idea to do this flower one. So I was looking for something to use for the bottom. That is so cute, turned out so cute. Um, I went out looking for that, but then I found this little container, which I made, and then this teeny tiny teacup. You know, I just made the bumblebee one, right? And I did, I mean, I did, wasn't looking for this. I didn't know it was gonna be out there, but beehive. And then I did find this egg cup last night when I was going through some stuff in the storage closet. And for whatever reason, eyeball inspired, <laughs> complete with eyelashes. I don't know. So, um, and then as they're drying, I put all my trims together in one place so they're all in these drawers here um instead of five different places because that wasn't serving me and my pin cushion collection is now on the wall and will be on the wall um <laughs> i'm not mad about it i don't know what i'm going to put up there i do have a hanging bar here i also have more of these shelves so it's possible that as the collection grows i can put more pin cushions up there but we'll see i'm going to just leave it the way it is right now but yeah, not mad at it. Um, so it's pretty cool. And just in case you missed it, I have, I've, I've made most of these. So a mushroom, a turtle. We have this little doll. She can be used as a pincushion, although she doesn't have any in her right now. I have a strawberry, um, porcupine, um, tomato, tomato, <laughs> um, bumblebee. Bird, I didn't make this one and he's actually a uh, pin cushion and tape measure. I bought this one. There we go. Um, this flower tomato thing, he's got clips on him. Uh, owl, he doesn't have any pins in him but he could be used as a pin cushion. Um, this one was in my mother-in-law's things. So we saved that. We've got this one. I bought this and it had the pin cushion on top. It had something else around here and I, I rearranged that to hold scissors and like thread and stuff. It's pretty cute. This one, which we just made, which is our mushroom one. And then this one I made a long time ago. So yeah, I, I have this thing for pin cushions. I don't know, I don't know what to say. Anyway, vlog is edited and rendering, and as soon as it's done, we get it loaded to YouTube and scheduled out. I am going to go grab my crochet, which is still downstairs, take a picture of all that crochet thread, um, and see if I can gift it to somebody on Buy Nothing. Um, and, and or the, uh, there's another um, Facebook group for our local area that, um, people give things away on so I'll post it on both and see what happens and yeah that's it we'll probably go for a walk later when mister's off of work and um, yeah I ended up not going to the gym yesterday I don't know if I have that on camera or not because I just was not feeling it so anyway all right that's it for the minute I will be back hey guys uh, yeah I'm still in my pajamas <laughs> It's nine o'clock ish or something. I don't know. We'll see. It's probably after nine. Uh, yeah, almost nine thirty. Um, I do want to uh, want to, and I'm going to force myself to leave the house today. I didn't. I don't think I vlogged it all yesterday. Um, between babysitting Junior and counseling, I just. 
just, I just didn't. I did finish another blanket, so that's a thing. And I'm gonna reload my crochet bag with the next project today. Um, but after counseling yesterday, <laughs> I do now have homework. I'm not good enough. The stories you tell yourself are ruining your life. And so I'm supposed to read this, do the first couple of worksheets before my next counseling appointment. Yeah, it's a thing. Anyway, uh, life and times of somebody struggling with mental health issues, right? Anyway, all right. So we're going to turn off some lights. Um, I was going to say grab my phone, but it's in my hand. We're filming on it. We're gonna go downstairs, force myself to get showered and dressed and cleaned up and get out of the house. And yes, I said force myself. Uh, so, yeah. All right, I do have some creative things I wanna do today um, for my mental health and well-being, but also just because I wanna do things. So I will be doing those later. Um, I don't have to be anywhere until lunchtime, which I'm supposed to meet hubby back here at lunchtime. Um, so I'm going to go. There's one thrift shop I didn't go to the other day because it wasn't open on Monday. So I think I'm going to go there. And then I might go by Fred Meyer because I'm looking for something to weight the bottom of my next project. So um, I'll explain more about that later. But right now, time to get showered and changed. Shopping your pajamas in your pajamas is not a good idea. All right, I'll be Hi back. Hi guys. It's a little bumpy and shaky. Oregon <laughs> Roads. <laughs> Oregon Roads and dark. Uh, we are headed to the grocery store. It's after seven o'clock on Wednesday. I, all day today I was thinking it was Tuesday. I don't know what the deal is. It's Wednesday. Wednesday. I did end up going thrifting this morning for a little bit and I went to Joann's to pick up a couple things. Um, I'm working on a new crochet pattern of a little cactus shaped like a hand. I'll put it here if I get it done before I edit the video, which I probably will. It's cute. It's cute, yeah. And the fingers are repositionable so you can have it do the peace sign or whatever you want to do. Thumbs up. Thumbs up, yeah. You can do that. Under one finger, thumbs up. Number one, yeah. So um, anyway, I'm working on that. I'm gonna make two of them because I'm gonna send one to a friend. And um, it's pretty fun to work on. It's turning out a little bigger than I thought it would, but that's probably hook size. Um, I could have gone down a hook size or more, but that's fine, I don't, it's fine. I'll stick with the way it is. And um, yeah, I just got wrapped up in doing that all afternoon. <laughs> I have absolutely no excuse. I just did that all afternoon. I did nothing else. So there's that. Um, oh, I shouldn't say that. We did book um, one of two vacations for next year. We're in the or one of three, uh, really. Um, the one of them's in the pl uh, planning process because it involves more than just the two of us, and the other one we have to decide where we're going. So there's that. So there will be travel vlogs look to look forward to next year and being creative while you're out and about and traveling so because I'll you know me I'm gonna bring stuff with me anyway we decided because this weekend we want some free time to just go do something fun and not have to do chores and shit and my husband's got some Masonic stuff to do isn't that this weekend yes I have, yeah I have Masonic thing this weekend yeah and Saturday morning and we don't want to be bothered with grocery shopping. I've said it before, I'll say it again. I hate grocery shopping. I'd rather clean the toilet. No. Well, no, I don't like doing that either. But we're gonna go tonight and do the grocery shopping and then we'll have a late dinner. And yeah, it's all good. Tomorrow's babysitting today, day, so Junior will be over for most of the day and I'll get up early so I can get some work on the cactus or something done before he gets to the house. Uh, catch up on drawings or something and yeah that's all good so anyway it's awfully dark out jesus it must be uh winter winter's coming winter's coming all right and it's a full moon so weird day of weirdness anyway all right that's it for the minute i'll hey be everybody. back it is a few minutes after nine 
and Junior will be here fairly soon, I would guess. We don't ever know exactly what time he's coming, but sometime between now and 10.30. Um, I've been up since about 6.30, so I could get a few chores done before he gets here. I do have some creative things I wanna do, but I probably won't get them done until after he goes home. Um, that being said, I do have a few minutes. I might do at least today's daily drawings. I also want to finish my mood cactus. And um, the basic structure is done. Now it's just the decorations So and the Velcro uh, or hook and loop tape, whatever you want to call it. Um, so yeah, I might, I might, I think that's a good idea. I might go upstairs and do today's daily drawings and some writing because I haven't done that in a couple of days and get that done. So let's do it. All right, I'll be back. It is Friday, October 18th. It's almost two o'clock. Um, I got another uh, mood cactus done today to send off to a friend. So I'm gonna try to get that in the mail this weekend. Um, I'm also making some more amigurumi. It's been a while since I did. I'm working on a little turtle. He's cute, isn't he? Um, but our ring camera, and it's going off again right now as we speak, has been going off like crazy today because the deer are out in the front yard looking for corn and there isn't any out there. So I'm gonna go grab a bowl or two and grab some corn and feed the animals, which I'm not really supposed to do, but I'm gonna do it anyway, because that's what we do. All right, I'll be back. I don't know if you can see that, but that movement back there is the deer. They're just waiting for me to move so they can come get some food. There's at least two of them back there. Anyway, got three. There is, and you guys probably cannot even see it, but there is another one back there. The whole herd's here today. Hello everybody, it's Saturday, it's 2.07 p.m. I just now realized, I don't think I did a whole lot of vlogging yesterday and I completely forgot to do any today until now. I've been making amigurumi uh, in the last few days and I'm going to continue to do so. There's quite a few patterns that have piled up that I want to try and I don't have any room in my closet for any more sweaters and I, um, the blanket cabinet is full. So um, anyway, I made a little turtle, we'll put a picture here. And I'm making a little goose and before I get this edited I'm sure it'll be finished. So here's a picture right here. Um, I don't know what one I'm going to do next, but we'll see. Um, I use a particular couple of kinds of yarns for doing the amigurumi. I like making little ones. I don't, I've made a few in the blanket yarn, make giant ones, not my favorite. Um, so, um, I'll link the packs of yarn that I like to use down below. Anyway, we're going to head out. I ran a bunch of errands this morning while Mr. was busy. And um, the one we didn't do yet was get a birthday present and card for adopted son-in-law, Brian. Um, his birthday's next week. And so we want to get him a card and a, give, and a gift. And so we're going to go do that. If I can talk him into it, we'll also go into Age Mart because we like Age Mart. And we don't really need any snacks in the snack cabinet, but I mean, it's Age Mart. So, we'll see. They might have ice coffees. 
they might have the iced coffees that I like, which only seem to be at H Mart, and Korean popcorn. Don't know why I like Korean popcorn. And other stuff. And other stuff, yeah. So we'll see. I'll be back. And then, yeah, I don't know what's up with the rest of the day. I have no idea. But I'll let you know. Okay, I'll be back. go check the mail. Yes, I put my hair. I was crocheting. It was bugging the crap out of me. I got the goose done. Um, next is going to be a turtle. I've been collecting these patterns from uh, books at the library, all over the internet, um, here and there into a book. Anything that I think I might want to make for a while. So my plan is to go through the book from front to back and make them all. So... I did order some more um, of the, there's a certain kind of yarn I like working with. And it comes in bundles on Amazon and you can't just order one color, you gotta order all the colors. So I'm looking for some alternatives. Um, they're not expensive yarn, it's inexpensive acrylic yarn. One of them is by Karen, Karen's, Little, little, little crafters, little creations, little, cre cre little something. Anyway, I'll put the name here. Um, it's a really good yarn for doing this with, and I use like usually a three millimeter, three and a quarter millimeter crochet hook. So, anyway, I like doing them, they're fun. All right, got a bunch of stuff in the mail. I don't know. We gotta go through that. I think our ballots are in here. So, anyway, the other yarn should be here today. Meanwhile, when I am out and about, I'm gonna look for like bigger balls. I don't know. I, the little ones are fine. All right. Can you tell my brain is all over the place today? Because, hello. All right, I'll be back. Hey guys, it is just after 10 p.m on Saturday, October 19th. Um, got the goose done for sure, and I'm starting on a squirrel, um, which should be cute. So here are two of the uh, preferred kind. I'm having problems with that light. You see that? Um, kinds of yarn I like using for the amigurumi. They're both inexpensive, relatively speaking. There's a third one um, by Karen. It's a selection of mini skeins. I'll put the name right here. Um, anyway, this one's by Mira Handcrafts. And you can get these bundles of colors. They're pretty small, but honestly, you don't need... Um, I don't like you doing the big amigurumi. I like doing the little ones, so I don't need a ton of yarn. And for the most part, this has two of each color, which is, for me, that's good to do in Amagumi. This is a newer one, but I think I'm gonna like it. This is from Far From Home, or, uh, let's see. Uh, it's just acrylic yarn. I think the listing said it was Hearth and Home. I don't know that it actually is. Um, but it's, again, another bundle of multicolors. Not super expensive. I was going to try to see if I could make a mini mood cactus to put in my car. Um, and this does. This one actually does have a, a good green for that. So maybe. 
We'll have to see if I can size down the pattern. Um, but yeah, it's been a good day. I, well, I did a bunch of errands this morning while Bob was out. And then when he got back, we had lunch and went and got a birthday present for adopted son-in-law and ran a couple quick errands. Uh, birth daughter needs to come by and pick up some paperwork she needs, but she, I thought she was going to do it today, but she didn't. Um, but probably tomorrow. Um, Mr. wants to go to the gym in the morning. I might go with him. Again, we'll see. I didn't end up doing that last week, so we'll see. Um, right now, I think I'm going to. I'm going to download a few books to my Kindle. And I think if I do go with him, I'll just spend some time on the treadmill walking and reading. Um, I'm not a huge gym person, but that is the kind of thing I do when I do go. And I need to get steps in anyway. I did stop by Joann's today and picked up some more uh, polyfill. Not a super huge bag, just a little one. Uh, since I am doing amigurumi right now, I needed some more polyfill. I also have been known to use old pillows. Um, I wash them really well and then pull all the stuffing out. <laughs> um, but yeah, it's it was, you know, a calm, chill day. I did get my homework book bound into something. I will start reading it and working on my first two worksheets tomorrow. I'm not looking forward to it up to it because it just, you know, it's going to be good for me, but it's just a process of really thinking and analyzing things. There we go again. Sorry, you guys. Hold on. It's not as good over here, but at least it's not flashing in your face. Um, it's just about, you know, analyzing and thinking about things. Um, but I, it took me longer than I thought it would to find a, a report cover to put it in. I really wanted to punch holes in it and have it in a cover. It's not perfect because, um, some of the words are like stuck in the spine, but I think it's good enough. And it, I could always pull it out and read the pages if I need to. Um, but yeah. Anyway, it's good enough for the moment. At least it won't get lost. <laughs> All right. I think that's it for right now. It's been a chill week, but I did get some creativity done. And, you know, for me, that's what it's all about, getting um, things done. We also planned some upcoming vacations, one of which next year is going to be to Arizona. The other one's going to be to Italy. So there's that. Sometime in 2025. And we have a third one we're going to plan. So... You know, there's exciting stuff happening, and yeah, it's all good. If I can do it, you can do it. That's my message today. So anyway, what is your favorite thing to make right now? Um, yes, I'm still painting and sketching and that sort of thing, but I'm really enjoying getting back into needle crafts, sewing and crocheting, obviously. Um, it's what I started out doing when I was a little kid, and I'm just right back to there. Um, and I'm not upset about it in the slightest. What's making you happy? Anyway, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Leave uh, relevant comments, questions, concerns, input down below. What would you like to see here on the channel? Leave something down below. And that's it for this week, I think. The little turtle pattern, by the way, is really cute. It's out of a book I found from the library. Um, so check your local library if you want, um, you know, patterns. A lot of them are online too, but the little turtle was so easy. The goose is more complicated. Uh, this I'm where the squirrel I'm working on right now, so much more complicated. And the squirrel, I believe, is a pattern you can download online. And the goose might be too. And if they are, I will link them down in the video description down below. So check it out. Also relevant links to support the free content here on YouTube. And so, so, so much more. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And above all, go out and do something nice for yourself because you deserve it. I'll see you next week. Bye, guys.